The amount of alcohol consumed at home in Ireland rose to 51% in 2016, according to the CSO. The proposed alcohol bill being discussed aims to set out a minimum pricing for alcohol in off-licences and bars. The bill also proposes warning labels to be put on alcoholic packaging. Under the new rules, Dutch gold will cost a minimum of €1.58. Guinness will cost €1.66. A bottle of Smirnoff ice will rise to €20.71. An off-licence worker said that the bill won't affect future sales as all retailers will be in the same boat and the habits of drinkers won't change. We spoke to students on campus on their thoughts. It would probably like drive more people to drugs because drugs are going to be cheap, like alcohol probably be direct than drugs so they're probably going to do that. I'm from the United States and alcohol is a lot more expensive here compared to the United States so uh, we're already kind of like being careful with money on, on that front, I guess. Uh, it probably would, yeah. I'd expect you, you'd probably end up pre-drinking a lot more and you wouldn't be going to the bar as much, you know, the pub trade's probably gone, so... Yeah, it probably would affect my decision, I, I suppose. People, like, especially students, don't have that much money to spend going out, so obviously if drink prices go up, then probably less people will, will go out. Well, people still go out, but probably not as often, I'd say. Speaking to the owner of Newbar, he said that the minimum pricing legislation would not affect the business as their prices would never go that low. He also said that the second part of the legislation, which looks at putting warning labels on bottles and cans, would not come into effect in Newbar as they would each have to put on the labels manually. Helen O'Neill, DCU TV News.